just kicking down the cobblestones, looking for fun and feeling groovy. Ba -da 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 -da, feeling groovy. Hello, lamppost, what you knowin'? I've come to watch your flowers growing. Ain't you got no rhymes for me? Do what to do, do, I'm feeling groovy. Da -da 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 -da, feeling groovy. I got no deeds to do, no promises to keep. I'm dappled and drowsy and ready to sleep. Let the morning time drop all its petals on. Life, I love you, all is groovy About you, but I'm feeling groovy. Hello, my veteran friends and all my friends that are looking in to learn how to play the 59th Street Bridge song, otherwise known as Feeling Groovy by Simon and Garfunkel. And today we are using our old friend the capo hack. Uh, for those of you that aren't familiar, what I call the capo hack is using a clamp-on capo and uh, applying it from the treble side of the guitar. Um, in this case, we're on the second fret on strings one through five. We're leaving that sixth string uncapoed. And uh, what, what, what we're achieving by doing this is when we get to a D shape, we've got this beautiful deep bass string effect makes the D shape sound very full. Okay, so let's talk about feeling groovy. I think it's an appropriate name because the whole song is a groove. Um, it goes something like this. So if you can get that down, you can play this song. Um, so let's talk about the chords a little bit. So the first chord is a C add nine. Okay, the way I'm achieving that is I'm using my middle finger on the fifth string, three frets above the capo, and I'm um, using my ring finger on the second string, three frets above the capo, and my pinky string one, three frets above the capo. So we've got this modal sounding C here. It's a five string chord, you don't play the sixth string. Okay, second chord is a G, it's a form of a G. You're just dropping your fretting position down to the fifth string second fret. So we're not playing the, the sixth string on this one either. Um, so we're C at nine, G, and then we play that D shape. And then we play a, what I'm calling a G5. Um, so I'm uh, keeping this same kind of um, fretting position with my ring and pinky on um, strings two and one respectively on the third fret. And um, I'm fretting the sixth string in the same position as the uh, pinky and the ring. The little bit tricky thing about it is because we're relative to the uh, nut of the guitar now and not the capo, this is actually fret five. Um, but for simplicity's sake, I will just state that as a disclaimer, but for simplicity's sake, I've shown it as uh, fretted on the third fret because you're actually fretting in the same place that you're fretting strings um, one and two. Okay, so that's the groove. So, <clears throat> you can play 
play this a number of ways. This interpretation that I'm doing, there's a pluck of the bass note, and then there's a up, down, up. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, up, down, up. pretty much the whole thing. So let's close out with the last verse and the last chorus. I got no deeds to do, no promises to keep. I dabbled and drowsy and ready to sleep. Let the morning time drop all its Petals on me, life I love you all is groovy. feeling groovy, we're grooving away. Um, one thing I didn't mention is the ba da, uh, you know, the ba da 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 da's are, um, the last one is different, that last set of ba da 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 is very different than the, uh, in the first two verses. So in the first two verses, it's ba da 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 feeling groovy, ba da 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 simple song but um, when, you, when you really break it down um, it's not that simple to execute because we're doing some picking and strumming. It takes some practice but I think it's a really good sound for this song. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed singing and playing Feeling Groovy. Have a groovy week, and I look forward to sending you another song very soon. Until then, adios, my friends.